to others, but that we shall watch and be sober. The truth is soon to tri triumph gloriously, and all who now choose to be laborers together with God will triumph with it. The time is short. The night soon cometh when no man can work. The time is coming when there will be as many converted in the day as there were on the day of Pentecost after the disciples had received the Holy Spirit. Many have let the gospel innovation go unheeded. They have been tested and tried, but mountainous obstacles have seemed to loom up before their faces, blocking their upward march. Through faith, perseverance, and courage, many still surmount these obstructions and walk out into the glorious light. Almost unconsciously, barriers have been erected in the straight and narrow way. Stones of stumbling have been placed in the path. This will all be rolled away. The safeguard which false shepherds have thrown around their flocks will become as not. Thousands will step out into the light and work to spread the light. Heavenly intelligences will combine with the human agencies. Thus encouraged, the church will indeed arise and shine. Throwing all her sanctified energies into the contest, thus the design of God is accomplished. The lost pearls are recovered. During the loud cry, the church, aided by the providential interposition of her exalted Lord, will diffuse the knowledge of salvation so abundantly the light will be communicated to every city and town. The earth will be filled with the knowledge of salvation so abundantly will the renewing spirit of God have crowned, crowned with success then intensely active agencies that the light of present truth will be seen flashing everywhere. And this is not impossible. This is something that will happen because there's so much technology nowadays that this will spread very fast. And the same Jesus that the 12 disciples saw going up in heaven, that's the same Jesus that will come back soon for us. The same Jesus that Moses served, Abraham, Joseph, and all the prophets will come soon for, for his church, for his people. So let's not sleep anymore. Let's be awake and sober to receive our Lord. Amen. Amen.